Friends, it's another new day. God has given and God has made it to you and me. Therefore, let us believe and pray. Therefore, I want to share the word of God with you. Jehovah, thank you for this moment. As I'm going to share the word, may you be a blessing to every person who is listening. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. My friend, I want us to go straight to the book here. The book of uh, James chapter 1 verse 19. The Bible talks about being slow to talk. Don't be so quick to answer. Be, and then be easy to listen. When it comes to that, many people fear what the word says. You know someone can talk, I love you, and you're just there. But this pens it depends on how you handle the matter. It depends with how you handle the matter. I want to take you to that scripture. It says, my dear brother and sister, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. Many people saw, especially those who are called Christian, we are so quick to get angry and we are so quick to take action and at the time you take action which will not even take you to heaven. And again the Bible says, be slow to speak. Be slow to answer. You know, this tongue we have, this tongue here, it carries a lot. It carries blessing. It carries curse. And many people want to be blessed. They don't want to be cursed. And when you want to be blessed, you need to do only one thing, is to dwell in God. It is to stand with God. It is to walk with God so that you will be able to conquer. But on conquering, you need to walk. Be slow on talking. Be slow on answering. Let people say that this person, nowadays, it seems that he has money now. He doesn't want to talk to us. Talk with things which are useful to the to who are God. Many people when they get money, that's when now they can talk. When they don't have money, they can't talk. Let me assure you, the Bible has said so. Be slow to talk. Be good on listening. And listening, you will find that when you listen to the word of God, you will find that you are blessed. When you listen to people, you will know many things, bad things and good things. The Bible says again in the book of Proverbs chapter 18, verses 21, the Bible says this one, the tongue has the power of life and death, and those who love it will eat its fruit. Some people love their tongue, what their tongue says. And at times, tongues can lie to you. You say what is not there. But I come to tell you, my friend, walk with Christ. Surrender to, to Him. Surrender to our God, because He'll never leave you. In Jesus' name. Father, those who know have listened to the word, may you bless them. Bless their family, bless their offices, bless their work. Let them be slow to talk, but quick on listening. Lord, teach us your word. Teach us to know you better. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. You are there, not born again. I want to pray for you. Repeat this word after me. Father, I come before you. I am a sinner. I have sinned against you. Write my name in the book of life. Forgive me, Lord, for what I have done wrong. Forgive me. Today I start a new life with you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. 
Father, I pray for that person who have repeated the prayer. Lord, may you forgive them. Forgive them. Write their name in the book of life. Today, may you stand with them as they walk with you. Let them never be disappointed about your word. Let them go ahead with your word. In Jesus' name I say, Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus, for the word of today. In Jesus' name I say, Amen. My friend, you are blessed. Be slow to speak, but be quick to listen. Be sharp on listening. Shalom, peace of God be upon your life. In Jesus' name.